Hey y'all, it's Nick for Undefeated Productions, and welcome back. And this is where we're we'll discussing one of two final trades that I need to talk about. And this one is we discussing the David Phelps trade that sent him from the Milwaukee Brewers to the Philadelphia Phillies. Before we get started, again, as always, hit that like button, subscribe. My trade uh, deadline recap video will be coming out tomorrow. You won't want to miss that. Alrighty, this trade is an interesting one, and the Phillies, who again, uh, we stated previously when they acquired Workman and Hembry, that they've had a struggling bullpen, and now they're going out and acquiring yet another bullpen arm, this time right-hander David Phelps. Phelps so far in 13 innings in 2020, is pitching to a 2.77 ERA, 20 strikeouts, and a point. 6.92 whip. That whip is elite. In his career in 601 innings pitch, Phelps is pitching to a 3.83 ERA, 576 strikeouts, and a 1.311 whip. So overall, Phelps had Tommy John surgery in 2018. He looked solid with uh, Toronto and the Cubs last season, and now he's been amazing with Milwaukee. And Milwaukee are, is able to trade them away for three players to be named later. Those three players are Juan Geraldo, Israel Puello, and Brandon Ramey. Ramey is the oldest of the three. He was drafted 30th round in 2018. He was uh, born August 31st in, uh, oh, in 2000. So he's so he just turned 20, like yesterday. Puello is still 19, almost turns 20. And then Juan Geraldo is 19 right now, just turned 19. So again, a handful of right-hand young pitchers. Uh, the, the Brewers are uh, getting out of this. There are three players to be named later. So, again, not on the 60-man pool, not prospects yet. But, again, three young pitchers, you know, who knows? This, this trade may pay out amazing for the Brewers come a couple, you know, a couple years from now, three, four years from now. So, overall, I want to know what y'all think about this trade. I think right now the winner of this trade is the Phillies. You guys are addressing your terrible bullpen. But in the long run, it does look like this trade is going to be pretty good for Milwaukee. If these three youngsters... Uh, proved to be anything. I think it's a great trade for Milwaukee. So overall, right now winners are going to be the Phillies, but in a couple years, who knows? The Brewers might win. But overall, let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Again, hit that like button and subscribe. I got one more trade video talking about the Taylor Williams trade, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Thanks for watching.